मॉर्निंग टूडे वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट निफ्टी दी स्टॉक एंड फाइनेंशियल मार्केट एंड द इकोनॉमिक कंडीशन ऑफ द वर्ल्ड सी निफ्टी आई हैव रिटन एन आर्टिकल निफ्टी में रिपीट इट्स बिहेवियर लाइक नाइनटीन नाइनटी टू एट द टाइम ऑफ परशद मेहता स्कैम फर्स्ट राइस एंड देन फॉल आई यू सी आई हैड प्रोडिक्टेड दैट द स्टॉक मार्केट would take a ugly turn because of the combinations as per jatak parijat saturn aspecting jupiter and ketu that uh, parameter is activated but the point is that saturn has also as seen from the past at the time of 1992 saturn has to be progressive and saturn will be progressive from the 23rd of october so <clears throat> there is every likelihood of some scam also being unearthed and the nifty can rise to unexpected levels although i had predicted first that the nifty will cross 17000 but now it is every uh, there is possibility that it can cross 18500 or maybe even 19000 because saturn will only be progressive from the 23rd of october so till 23rd of october there is likelihood of market being volatile may vibrate between 18000 18500 or even 19000 it is very difficult to give the exact figures let me be very honest about it no astrologer can calculate whether the nifty can cross 19000 but it is only assumption because the saturn will only be progressive from 23rd october we have absolutely parallel positions like 1992 saturn was in capricorn from and in retrogression <coughs> from 23rd of october to uh, sorry 23rd of may to 16th of october and we found that after 16th of october after in 1992 i am talking that after saturn was progressive the market crashed but when saturn was retrograde the market rose to almost 27% and when market when saturn was progressive then the market fell down even more than 27% so we could have absolutely parallel situations the other parallel situations there are three situations one saturn is becoming progressive on the 23rd of october so there is a likelihood of the market taking a reversal first rise and then fall the second is that as per jatak parijat saturn will also aspect jupiter and also aspect ketu jupiter will also become direct on the 23rd of november and then the <coughs> second the third parameter is that saturn and mars will become they will be in six eight axis the moment mars goes in gemini it can trigger the things from the 16th october to 15th november 2022 and the third one parameter is that on the 28th of april 2023 23 again we have the planetary combinations for the market taking a hit so this is all friends i just wanted to update this is my research this is a research article and my research and if my research go, goes wrong please do not blame me because there are no research work done by our stalwarts because at that point of time the stock and financial markets were not there and no study is there a concrete study is not there all the astrologers have to work very hard you would say that i had said that the nifty will just touch 17000 or may cross 17000 but now it is almost touching 18000 so the point is that the, the numerical figure it is very difficult difficult to give the numerical figure but you can only indicate the time frame when the market can go up and when market can go down and see what had happened before when these planetary combinations were there saturn is also karka for mandi so saturn progressive state 
and retrograde state will play a role in the rise and fall of nifty so this is all friends i just wanted to share that the market now can cross and it can be volatile also it can be volatile also the market between 15th of october to 15th of november will be volatile so it can be it will be bearish also and we can have volatile trends also but the real break will only come when saturn will be in progressive state after 23rd of october and after 23rd of november when both saturn and jupiter will become direct so this is all friends i just wanted to share uh, <coughs> on the stock and financial markets and uh, let's see what happens uh, i have done a thorough study because i got comments that uh, i had predicted that nifty will only touch 17000 it has crossed 18000 so i just reviewed everything and after reviewing lot of data is required and it's very difficult to go see every year so we can only see the saturn cycle because saturn is karka for mandi so this is all friends i just wanted to share thank you very much for listening to me have a good day bye bye